Recently, we just completed this with two of my colleagues and certainly my students at uh, Texas Tech University, which is we call the Sustainable Cabin, which is a design-build project which we started out uh, at an elective courses of mine, which is called a Product Design Elective. And we just completed this particular design-build project and it's now on its permanent site in Kroll, Texas. What's really significant on this is that we are looking at the basic building materials. For a start, we used an existing mobile home platform. It was from a double wide, which was 53 feet long by 13 feet wide. So instead of putting this all in a landfill, we went and chopped the trailer to our dimensions and basically added the materials which are sustainable, for example, also uh, bamboo flooring at the inside, natural pine as a cladding for the walls and ceiling, and cotton insulation, which is basically a recycled blue denim cotton, which is turned into thermal insulation. So those components from a material base are sustainable. And then in addition, we went further and we basically set this cabin off the electro electrical grid and therefore now have solar panels who are having the only means of power. And the other th part is basically uh, harvesting the rainwater and having a compost toilet on site. So it basically is a self-sufficient uh, dwelling. And for us is we can provide a learning experience which the student later on can't really repeat because they will have to generate a profit. Furthermore, the student's going to work on projects where they are in actual offices, so that hands-on approach of touching the 2 by 4 they will never have that because architecture draw buildings, they don't make the actual buildings. But with that hands-on approach, what they will have, they have this modern experience that, ah, I remember how this was when I worked on that. This is actually not that easy. It was quite tough. And it gives a better understanding for the craftsman who is they're dealing it for a career to come. And I think that's a very important aspect we're providing here. So.